Denver, the AXO program, where you have a lot of our young African American students who are doing a lot of positive things. And so I asked one sister to be a judge on the program. And when I asked her to be a judge, she came, and when she got there, she's a radio person, and she said, you know, once I got here and saw what was happening, I feel so good because when I went down Chicago Avenue, I saw a group of brothers just hanging on the streets. This gave me hope. She said it looked like everything was all over. And so when I got here and people started uh, doing what they could do, showing all the talent they had, it made me feel good. So this is the young lady, uh, Ms. Uh, Carolyn Page, and her husband that uh, did the program. And I was glad and very happy to be a judge to see these young African Americans people doing things. So don't let anybody fool you. A lot of our young people are doing positive things. People don't know it, but it's good that these things are dead. And these things have been going on for how long? Since uh, 1978. 1978. And, and they had a number of people that I recruited from this area to be there. And they thanked us for it, so we're going to thank them for it. So I would like to have Ms. Page say a few words about the program, even though she didn't necessarily come here to speak. But it's important that we know what is happening in our community. It's important that we know the positive things in our community because a lot of people are not out there like we are don't really know what the positive happens. Ms. Carolyn Page. I'm not a teacher at all. But um, thank you for mm -hmm. understanding. Uh, I'm actually a Chicago police detective, just so you know. And I've been um, a member of the Chicago Westside NAACP since December of 2003. My husband got me into this. And he was the Axel chair at the time. And I got to working with this program. Um, and I, I love working with kids because as a police, I'm like, all I see people do is get arrested by me. And I'm going to ask you this, if you do it, do it. I know you did it and I'm gonna lock you up. So, but it's, I like to get them ahead of time to try to help them and direct them to a better path, you know. And um, I'm, I've been doing this as the co-chair since 2005. And um, I feel like I could be the co-chair and do a lot of which was created back in 19, actually before 1978, when it came to the NAACP. In 